Yes, I think we'll still be aging. I don't think there's going to be any magic pill that will suddenly stop aging. What I think will happen is that there will be a slowing in the process of aging and therefore a delay in the onset of diseases. And with better medical research and better available treatments, and particularly with what's called genomics, or the introduction of gene efforts, and regenerative medicine, which means the ability to replace cells, tissues, and organs, we may see people much stronger, healthier, and vigorous in their 120th year. I mean, we will uh, still have uh, the effects if we continue to expose ourselves to the sun, we're going to have wrinkles. If we continue to smoke, we're certainly going to have wrinkles. There are things we can do to make ourselves appear more attractive as we grow older if we have the discipline to do it. Alcohol, too, is a huge problem. And people don't realize how serious alcoholism is in America. Well, we only have one real example, and that was an interesting French woman named Jean Camin. And she had apparently a great sense of humor right up through her, the end of her life, which occurred at 122. So she was quite remarkable. I don't know all the details, but there's one great story that at the end of one of her birthday celebrations when she was like 120. And by that time, of course, journalists from all over Europe would come to see her in Arles, France. And at the end of one such occasion, the cake had been cut and everything was done. This young Parisian journalist with hesitancy in his voice said, well, Madame Calma, I, I guess I'll see you next year. And she said in a nanosecond, I don't see why not. You look to be in pretty good health to me.